Hey there, welcome to a new vlog. Yeah, I just wanted to say I don't have that much to mention, but I was planning to make some Dutch food sports um, which is mashed, mashed potatoes with mashed carrots and onion and uh, Dutch meatballs. But I will show you that another time because we're going to have Okay, but I'm going to have salmon actually, so <laughs> But, um, yeah, tomorrow I'm just going to have coffee somewhere in town And this week I'm also planning to go shopping And uh, I'll take you with me, of course And, uh, yeah I just, like, got confirmed that my friend is coming over with New Year It's like my mother is coming over for Christmas So, yeah, it's super nice for this year and uh, last year we were at Philip's parent, uh, family's place, which was very nice. But yeah, we yeah like we just like any other couple we have to like decide a bit where we like one year my family's one year Adia's family's like so we have to divide a bit. But we really had a good time. I'm not sure if I'm going to film tomorrow, but um yeah. At least when I go shopping this week. So, we'll see you later. Bye-bye. evening and I'm going to make a Dutch meal today and I'm going to make some Dutch meatballs with uh, stompels which is no it's both which is a stompels like mashed potatoes with carrots and onion and um, Sephora at least and Uniqlo um, definitely need to do some winter shopping soon as possible and uh, yeah and yeah also some new makeup actually so um, I'm taking you with me I'm going to buy a new bronzer nice at Sephora and the rest of the day or shopping we will see where I'm like uh, we'll be at 
this happened from Zara. We get back a beige one from H&M. My second forget bag actually is here and my trench coat from Zara as well. Today I'm wearing my finial trunks again with my old ring box. Some more knitwear for like staying out in the city. And my red nail polish from last year. And uh, it's a bit sunny and I'm now having a very warm actually. <laughs> well then, so let's have a walk to the city. Get a bit of some now we're heading out. Actually, I went to the two shops that I really wanted to go to, Lise to Sephora and Uniqlo. And uh, I also went to H&M. I need to be there tomorrow, actually. The headquarter, but um, yeah, for now, <laughs> I thought like, um, yeah, I wanted to go home, actually. <laughs> Had a nice walk anyway. It was nice to have a walk. So I'm going to show you what I bought. Uh, first, I'm going to say for the bibliotheques go home. And I've got at least a nice clean mask of Sephora. <laughs> a metafine. We'll kill this maybe tonight. And then I really needed some new one. I have been using the one of Revolution really a lot. But as you see, like almost every color, and I'm almost finishing this one. So um, yeah, I could still use these, I think, as setting powder. So we'll keep this still though. Well, I have one. I've got a new one of Too Faced. Really curious. Uh, I chose the Mods version. Like the glowing one was also very nice, but um, maybe I might try that one later on. But I really wanted to, a Mods bronzer for now. A long wear, which is super nice. Sorry to test this and I will show you later. It's the chocolates soleil, the bigger version. Oh. It's 
so well not burned anyway but look how pretty it's really it looks a bit like the um, girls makeup of the 90s that we usually <laughs> had this is the bronzer a nice mirror super nice really pretty and i think it said it smelled a bit like chocolate can we to test this might be doing this after but i will do in another time together with you and tell you what i thought of using to taste and um yeah i actually also want to use it uh, um as everyday makeup as a light eyeshadow as well been um using my revolution palette as well actually like for like quick contouring and as well as um, the very natural eyeshadow not every day but um she really want to use it as well for my eyeshadow so yeah and this one to my new everyday makeup routine. And then a Uniqlo. Like this item. And I tried like two patterns and two colors, but um actually yeah, i like this one the most on me and um yeah i didn't choose for a gray one or something i just wanted to have this pattern as well and i think i could actually combine it very good with a little basics and still like shake so it's not like the thickest um fabric but um a plus is that it's quite big and so you can just like wrap yourself in it like very well and i thought it looks just super cool with um any winter coat so i have my trench coat which is with knitwear still for me warm enough especially with like this item but um yeah i've been looking for all the winter coats as well and i think this would fit as well very good so i'm super happy with this as well <laughs> actually wanted to go to sustain again i haven't been here yet it's just i think maybe recently it has been opened in stockholm like city center so yeah about first i had like a coffee and smoothie stop at Kletos. it's a very cute uh cafe that if you 
Um, I'm in Stockholm. I should have a look. Look, it's very pink and cute. So, and um, yeah, about some things. It's the same thing actually. Some small stuff. So I will do a little haul and. Later on, um, Philip is going to be early back home from work, and then um, we're going to have lunch together, and then I'll take you with us as well. See back. So I'll show you. Thank you. It's okay, actually. Uh, my name is a cute score and I've seen like I've been searching looking a bit around like for rosemary and those kind of herbs and everything which is very nice with um, chicken in the oven for example or meat uh, they're very nice um, herbs there some croissants so yeah, I thought maybe like for Christmas when my mom's here or with any other kind of um, maybe already before Christmas, but I bought some low year. Was it called Laurel? Laurel in English? I don't remember. Nice sweet chicken or some kind of meat. Some herbs. Um, I was actually really longing for mustard and so I bought the Christmas mustard. I think my mother will love this too. See what makes it special. But I was just really longing for mustard. So I'm just happy I got this. Um, but what's special about what does it make it? Special vinaigre de vin blanc. Um, there's sugar. Like there is some white wine vinegar in it and sucre caramelisé. Um, okay, so it should be a bit sweet, sweeter maybe than regular mustard. We'll try. So it's possible. And um, I also had a bit like the ground. They really have some cute Christmas decorations. But these were the only thought, uh, ones that I really wanted to have. And these were like very cheap actually. These were 76 euro cent. Super cute for classic quirky tree <laughs> super cute I just bought two because I like to have like different ones in my tree and I want to surprise Philip as well so I was looking oh one is broken so I bought these in these cute colors. I actually bought like the blue one for sure, or the mint one. But um, yeah, I thought it would be <laughs> cute for a tree, but I'm not sure if we will keep those until Christmas. But yeah, <laughs> little present for Philip as well when he's coming home. And uh, that was it actually. And so we'll see you later with lunch.
It is castanian. But I think that looks cute. This morning we went to church and because it's all Saints Day and now we're going to have a romantic walk at the park and we're going to make some photos as well because of fall and I'm wearing this coat of Sara and this trench coat of Sara my H&M bag and as you can see I've been trying my new Too Faced makeup and yeah, Philip is ready too and this hair headband is from Zoe as well. And my Raven sunglasses. today but if you want to recreate recreate this look I just used my old brown colored um, BB palette eye palette and my new bronzer of um, Too Faced and I found some Hema brow gel which I've been using for a long time and I will put it added to my daily makeup like bag so that I will be using it until it's finished um, I didn't use any eyebrow pomade today I just wanted to have like full brows with the brow gel and on my lips I'm having the chocolate cap of um, NYX so yeah and I'm changing my outfit, obviously. And I'm wearing my vintage gum earrings. So, good morning. It's still 
fabric was like thinner than I had expected but this is actually a special kind of uh, heat tech some kind of so it will warm up actually uh, when it's attached to your body which is a good concept and yeah I'm just uh, going to get a parcel order which is just uh, a small walk a little walk from our house and on the day I'm going to work and um, I did some emails for some possible collaborations um, yeah. or we're actually like negotiating um, to see if there is some potential or not <laughs> and then <laughs> wear my weekday hoodie under it with my uh, workout pants, my Reeboks and trench coat back and back I really like this nail scarf actually and makeup I um, really love nail products of um, bronzer of <laughs> Too Faced and um, on my lips I now just have lip balm it's just a small run and then I'm back but, um, yeah just uh, also my lips are super dry you guys think it's really dry like a walk or cool I think and uh, yeah my mother by the way bought her flight tickets so she's coming um, during Christmas and then she'll she and my friend uh, is going to stay with New Year's um, Actually, are going to see each other as well for the, I don't know, they know each other from um, earlier when I was in high school, so it's actually quite fun that they will see each other as well. Okay, and then I have some time at home, I will unbox my parcel, and then um, I'll just um, change clothes. And up to work. Uh, it actually looks quite nice outside. Cool but nice. It's really like a bit like the winter Stockholm weather, which is not that bad actually. It's like a Swedish saying if you are dressed well, it's not cold. So, exactly. And the uh, Netherlands is a bit more windy and um, a lot of humid because of the rain has its charm as well but I'm more like a Stockholm person I think. And here I am again. I was just super curious for my parcel and what it looks like so I went straight back home and really love my scarf it's really keeping me warm so i believe in the heat tech of Uniqlo, which is super cool um so yeah let's unwrap it and yeah, i just i thought i'm going straight back home because yeah i'm going to work anyway later on the day so and uh so yeah so i got order from <laughs> yes, okay, and my face, like, it was what I was curious about, like, if the colors would be, like, bright enough, because it looks a bit different on different photos. But yeah, I must say this one I was looking for, so But it, you know, as this time because I think most, uh, because everyone likes 
oversized nowadays. We're combining oversized items at least. Like, um, that you don't have to, like at the trendy stores that you don't have to buy, like, necessarily oversized to have it oversized. So, uh, that's why I went for an S. Like, Isara, for example, has lots of oversized items already, and then you, when you have a we are having a small that you don't necessarily need to buy like an M or something anymore. So, ta-da! It's just like a classic one and I really like that it's brighter than the photos on some of the photos on the website. Um, but this is really cool and um wear this super chic like it's like the bourgeoisie trend and style which are very like very much um, and surprise and it's a, a, like a bit like long very super cool I will see it on my Instagram again as usual. And I thought like it's just it's just like so entry fall kind of print. Sure looks so cozy, even in January or something. But especially like with Christmas or anything. Super nice. Happy. <laughs> Santa Claus at Enco and then have a coffee somewhere. This is my outfits and I'm wearing my hunting boots again. So I still have those and they are perfect for winter and still cold.
some time ago but i'm going to focus a little bit today it's around four and i just got back home and um we're going to meet up with my friend and just relax uh, like that way so um just a little moment and then i'm going back home already again but we uh, she had this place called Reload of Heaven in there, so might have a look. And I'm having these earrings, which are from Mongo from some time ago. And uh, yeah, we'll just have a long walk to the city. So see you there.